Okay, here we are, the last uh, lesson in machine learning and cloud services. And this is a really uh, high level discussion of topic modeling and other machine learning methods. And this is Jeffrey Fox, April 2019, your instructor. All right, so I'm sort of, I would not view this as the deepest discussion I've ever seen of these topics, so let's just. Uh, but we only have a few slides to go. So we want to, this is actually an example of um, hidden, hidden no latent variables. We, we, uh, if we look at documents, they have an observation, which are the words in the document. And then under, um, but we want to really understand the essence of the document, what it's trying to say, and that is, uh, can often be called top, the topic. And these are, say, they're a form of hidden or latent factors. Um, so you, t you typically assume there are a certain number of topics, and each topic has a distribution of, of, of words, and a given document has multiple topics. And um, you want, to take Google News, you want to, uh, which I keep using, because it's a sort of best known example of this type of system that accumulates all the information on a certain topic. The, uh, March Madness uh, basketball championship, or the um, or North Korea, or what have you, have you. And um, we need to uh, find the topics, to actually summarize what's in the topics, predict for a given document which topics are in it, and model the correlation between topics and identify related documents. And there is a famous approach that does this from a brilliant person. Uh, Bly, who invented this, and it's uh, you call it latent to reshare allocation, which um, is the uh, most possibly the most powerful way of doing topic analysis, which has a hidden a k parameter, hidden va random variable, where the those variables have multinomial distributions, and they have a de Richelieu prior distribution, which is why it's called latent to Richelieu allocation, and you, this is a lie, I told you, there are some clusterings where you have sort of hidden clusters, which you don't see directly, and that's one, that's, this is an example of that. And this um, traditional aid distribution is, to, is, is something which is pretty important. You, you need to smooth the probabilities. And uh, that's done in physics by temperature, smooth things out. In this uh, statistics-based approach, you just use this prior. Actually, you can do the physics approach as well, and think of this prior as like a statistical distribution of the of the underlying variables. Um, then you need to have the words which are distributed in the in the document in the topics, and those so the your documents, topics, words, and the observation of the words and the topics are the uh, are the hidden variables. So here's some a few other um, examples. Reinforcement learning, which was famous because it was used by AlphaGo. Um, you need to map words into uh, into vectors of, of associated words with a neural net. Uh, we have generated adversarial networks. Um, where you have two networks, one generating candidates, the other evaluating. And then you have a variant of a neural net which is optimized to do time sequences. That's called a recurrent neural net. And all of these are very important statistical methods which we have not discussed. Thank you very much. That's the end of this short section on uh, topic modeling and other machine learning as part of the machine learning and cloud services um, presentation. Thank you.